everyone and welcome back to the channel. It's your favorite uh, Decepticon Danny and today I'm checking out da -da -da -da, RC from Earthrise and da -da -da -da, um, Alita from the Netflix and they're both the same mold but yeah Alita was released in Netflix and yeah RC was released in the Earthrise line and she's gonna be in the Kingdom line. If you didn't get this baby <laughs> in Earth, can you say that about women? You call them babe or is that? <laughs> Not acceptable. But yeah, whatever, you can call her babe. Um, you can get this at um, Earthrise Figure at Toys R Us, Walmart in Canada. Um, yeah, she's okay. I know a lot of people like that thrilling 30s RC. I have the one that comes with the comics, not the Legends version, the uh, regular release RC, and I never opened it. She just has, she's just on my wall, and she is, yeah, hung up in package sealed. I never played with that uh, Thrilling 30s one, so I don't really know, but um, I, I don't mind this one. I mean, uh, Wilbur was hating on it. I can understand why. You know, she's basically just a shell former, but that's okay. You I mean, you can see her tucked up in underneath. <laughs> kind of a disaster. Uh, I told Ninja Bill, my girl won't roll, Ninja Bill, in a chat once, because they weren't rolling. And then he, I think he was telling me how to like do it properly or to check something out. And I, I still don't, I don't think I can do it properly. But you know what? They still um, are OK. Um, I still kind of got them to roll after a while. But yeah, the alt modes, like, there's not much to say. This piece falls out very easily up top here. The Alita 1 looks pretty dashing. Yeah. Ooh la la, Alita 1, <laughs> RC, <laughs> but yeah, um, RC, I mean, Alita 1, I like the Alita 1 better, I'm gonna tell you, I'm not the biggest fan of RC, she was just a little too, like, damsel and distressy, and, like, I don't mind that, you know what I mean, I'm not like, oh, women can't be saved, no, where are the handsome men that save us, I'm looking for one, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, <laughs> I knew about RC, like, when I'd watched the 1986 movie. Like I said, she just didn't, like, intrigue me a lot. Like, it wasn't like, oh, I'm gonna be like that chick. <laughs> you know, she had the Princess Leia-like hair. And, I don't know, she was okay. I liked the relationship between her and Springer, I must say. Like, you know? And she was, like, even into Hot Rod for a second there. <laughs> but, yeah, I totally like this Alita more. Um, yeah, especially in the robot modes. We'll get them into their robot modes. But, yeah, these, these car modes... Ah! These car modes, I don't know, they just don't really do it for me. But, but what can you do, you know? Like, how could they be better? Are they cool in the first place? Not really. I mean, I never, when I saw RC Transform, I was like, eh, that's kind of lame. <laughs> but, I mean, whatever. To each its own. You can't judge a little Transformer on its alt mode. But, um, yeah, they, I never had the Thrilling 30 ones. I um, don't know if they're better. Um, these ones... I'm not gonna want to put them in this mode. Clamshell mode. Hey girls, clam up. Clamshell mode. Oh my god, I'm clamming up. He's so hot. Ah. Yeah, no, clamshell mode, whatever mode, gymnastics. Um, we went to our yoga mode. I don't know. They kind of remind me of like an old phone. Hey mom, I'm just at the park. I'm not doing anything bad. <laughs> but yeah, the alt modes are what they are. Let's check out those robot modes. Um, judge the girls there in their robot mode. Let's judge a woman for how she looks coming up next on the channel. <laughs> Alright, let's check out the RC. She's a little harder to pick up on camera with that glare. But yeah, this is the RC mold. Um, yeah, obviously you can see the shell forming part. She has that on the back, a little backpack. And yes, this is the part <laughs> that, yeah, is just you put it aside. They show her riding it like a surfboard, my friend. Could we get any more? Stupid. <laughs> I mean, I'm not doing that. I'm going to have to put that somewhere so I don't lose it. But yes, um, I think a lot of people would agree. Uh, just put do something with it. Even if she has a bigger backpack, I mean, just not as big. Like, make this half as big as it is and put this on her and it would be better. And, of course, people hated the, you know, lack of paint. Look at this gun. She just has a transparent gun. Girl. <laughs> They can't do nothing for you? <laughs> and yeah, like her face, no paint, no lipstick, no nothing, girl. <laughs> and the back of her panties, or like whatever that area is called, is just not painted. It's pink here, it's supposed to be pink in the back. Now I do like more this Alita 1 with the mold, because she's got way more going on. She's got her face painted, she's got lipstick, blue eyes, she's got an extra helmet, cool red little white 
outfit. I liked her in the show. Her back of her underwear, or panties, or whatever you're calling this these days, is red and painted in the back. So she has just a little more paint apps, and it makes her pop and look dope and look cool. And I actually don't mind this mold with her. What I wish that this still, you know, folded up into something, a little, maybe half of that plastic more used on the back, even if it made it a little more junky. Yes, because then it wouldn't be such a mess of like just like you know a clam the shell transforming ah, where am i gonna put this am i gonna lose it <laughs> But um, yeah, overall, other than that, I like that. I'm just not the biggest fan of female Transformers. <laughs> like, I don't mind them. They just kind of come out like just awkwardly shaped and I don't know. I really do like this Alita one, you know, like Moonracer and the other girls. I never even reviewed my Orthia um, combiner because, um, you know, Moonracer and them, I just, they have that huge backpack on them, and I really don't like that huge backpack on them. But, you know, even this, mi oh, the middle, what did I lose? A gun. Uh, this middle piece that um, uh, Alita 1, she turns, I don't mind that mold for Alita 1. It's not the best, um, but I didn't mind it, and the thing about it, I didn't like Starscream at all in that mold. thought that was one of the worst Starscreams with this mold I've ever seen in Powers of the Prime. I hate that Starscream, but this guy... <laughs> This guy. Ah, here we go. Offended or not, this woman. <laughs> uh, this gal. Uh, yeah, she's, you know, pretty big and chunky, but who's this miserable little green uh, guy? Here, he's worthless these days. I said smash him with a mallet or something. <laughs> but yeah, this girl, I got her out, you know, I got all of the pieces, and, you know, she is one stomping uh, chick. She's one tough lady, one tough combiner female. And I, I, I should do a thing on my combiners, even if I don't break them down totally and review them, because that's been done to death. But maybe if I just do something like this, like holding it, licking it, <sighs> smelling it. <sighs> she never smelled that in my friends. But yeah, no, she's cool. I also have that nicey, I'll show her off quickly. So yeah, I got this nicey, I haven't really done much with her. Um, just trying to do stuff with my other masterpiece guys. But yeah, no, I like this figure because it's just like, when did taking, making women like less like sexy and less objectified was a bad thing? The world's gone mad. <laughs> but uh, yeah, she's, she's a bombshell. I love this chick, this is great, this is, this is where toy she this is where it's at. <laughs> For a third party figure, I am down. But yeah, I do love the Transformer uh, fembots, you know? They are cool, they have their place, and one done well, that's great. I wouldn't say these toys are done super well, or even that great, sadly. I mean, I like the Alita one, I'm not gonna lie. Even though I don't like how you take all that stuff off and blah, 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 I do like this Alita one. But yeah, they do look somewhat interesting still on the shelf, and yeah, it's nice to have some variety. I don't mind them. Like I said, I think overall both these molds, this one, um, yeah, is my favorite so far, and I'll get my hands on that, uh, the other medic one, the blue RC, see what that's all about. But um, yeah, no, I like her. Um, yeah, they did this. For me, the Alita one kicks it out of the park. This one, not so much. But yeah, I liked her Alita one. I liked her and Optimus's dynamic and Siege. I'll take some inserts of these gals, I see them close up and all that. Stick around for the dancing and yeah, the wrap up video. But thank you for watching. Just thought I'd share a couple thoughts on these guys. <laughs> I can never win. What's your thoughts on these girls and yeah. But yeah, let's cut to those inserts. Stick around for that wrap up, yo.
thank you for sticking around and watching this video. I highly appreciate it. You know, I'm on Twitter, um, Tumblr, uh, Instagram, all links down below. And I, yeah, um, mostly Instagram is where I show a lot of my, my toy pickups and toy photography. Even though it's not real photographers, just take a picture of a toy and post it and be like, hey, I have this, yay, for me. But, um,. <laughs> Yeah, so check me out down there. Let's have some fun. Um, yeah, let's build this community. Let me know. Did you like these girls? Did you um? It's a, do you prefer the other uh? You know the other thirty thrilling thirties RC like Mr. Raptor or do you not mind these molds? Um, yeah, let me know what you think. But besides that, as usual, make sure to you know keep uh, being safe and doing all necessary things that we gotta do for now and yeah hopefully things will get better soon and yeah just yeah stay safe and hope you and all your loved ones and all that are healthy and um yeah doing well so yeah i love doing this let's do it again soon take care stay strong stay safe stay positive this dolphin might even catch you up on cybertron y'all goodbye